Hello friends, welcome to BSC Agriculture. If you are coming to my channel for the first time, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Your subscription and likes are always motivating us. If you have any doubt, please comment in the sections or else you can able to join us in the Instagram page, which is in the video description. So let's move to the video. In this video, we are going to see about fundamentals of entomology. I am going to cover the insect orders. Um, at that, I we are going to speak about the order Hemiptera. So. It is said to be the fifth largest order in the insect classification, the Hemiptera, which is said to be half and terra wings. So these insects are said to be known as the half winged insects. So while you can be able to see, they use it to have the half of the forewing and the full of remaining hind wing. So they use it to get these names. You can be able to see these in red cotton bud as well as the sting bugs of the plants. So. The common names are said to be known as the true bugs. So these are the bugs we are going to see in the Hemiptrian order. So the names of some of the Hemiptrian uh, bugs are the Asian bug, Jane water bug, as well as the leaf hopper and water boatman. So while seeing them about the characteristics of the Hemiptrian insects, the head is said to be known as <coughs> Opisthognath type and the mouth parts are said to be piercing and sucking type and uh, they use it to have two pairs of pistils like styles which are said to be modified mandibles and maxillae are said to be even present in these insects and styled rest in the crude labium and or rostrum which is in the body mouth part Bo both labial pulps and maxillary pulps are said to be atropine so they are composed and they use it to have a well developed compound ends and the antenna is said to be 4 to 5 segmented but 10 segmented in silets and 25 segment in male cochits. So it varies on some of the insects but the common one is they are said to be 4 to 5 segmented and the mesothorax is represented dorsally by the scutellum. So the body the body surface uh, which is used to have a mesothorax or scutellum where the triangle shaped one in the insect body is said to be known as the scutellum and after that they use it to have two pairs of wings the first pair half thickened the hemi elytra which is said to be known as the heterotra uh, and the continuously uniform thickened which is said to be known as the homoptra and the second pair is said to be known as the membranous one and the legs they use it uh, as jumping in silets as well as the natatorial in water bugs and the cerci are said to be always absent in this group of hemitrin insects so after that the metamorphosis usually done in these insects are said to be gradual metamorphosis and uh, they also use it to have a rarely complete one in some of the particular insects and the young ones which are said to be called as nymphs in this group of insects and after that they used to have an alimentary canal which is used to modify it as a filter chamber to handle the liquid food obtained from the crops and the crop organ in the alimentary canal or else you can able to call them as the digestive system is said to be absent in this group of insects and the salivary glands are universally present and malfusion tubules are 4 in heteroptera and 2 to 4 in homoptera insects and the absence on aphids and the extra oral digestion is said to be present and the sting plants and sound producing organs are present sometimes in this group of insects and many pests or species of the insects are said to be known as the significant plant pest so they are said to be known as the phytopagus they are only used to eat on the plant matter and some transmit human and animal diseases and which use it to act as vector and some are predators and as well as the terrestrial and aquatic organisms they use it to have the two classification so they are said to be known as have the two orders which is known as the heteroptera and homoptera so after that we are going to see about heteroptera and homoptera so we can able to see them as a different classification so we can able to remember uh, most of the points so hetero which is different and terra wings and homo which is uniform, mm, uniform and terra and which means wings so the heteroptera which is used to have a different nature of wings and the homoptera which is used to have a uniform nature of wings while seeing them as the classification the head is protect as well as the horizontal 
protect as well as the horizontal in nature so they use it to have prognathus egg and the head is deflux which is the opisthognathus hex mm, head and the basin on the forelegs they do not touch the head and the basin on the forelegs they touch the head and the beak arises from the anterior part of the head but the beak arises from the posterior part of the head and uh, the colla region of the head which is the mint ventral square face with part between labrum and four men magnum is said to be well defined and colla region not clearly defined in these home try insects and while seeing the all bugs possess piercing sucking and mouth parts from the rostrum so all of them are used to be known as the perfect suckers and uh, after that we are going to see on the some of the difference of heteroptera as well as the homoptera the pronotum usually gen greatly enlarged but the pronotum is always small and collar like in these insects and the scutellum which is triangle formulated um, plate and which is found between the wing bases well developed and the scutellum was not developed in these one and the four wing heavily sclerotized at the base and a pickle half of the membrane which is hemilatra and the four wing are of uniform texture they are frequently outer than the hind pack and left and right wings are overlap on the back side of the abdomen so wings are held roof like cover over the back and wings do not overlap in this group of insects honeydew's secretion is said to be a common one of the is said to be uncommon one in this one as the symptom of the crop and honeydew secretion is the common one in this one repertorial or odoriferous or scent glands are said to be present wax glands are usually present in these insects both terrestrial and aquatic only the terrestrial one herbivorous predators and blood sucking but these are only the herbivorous one is the which is the homoptera and while seeing their economic importance they used to have often vectors of many plant diseases in different insects and they, there are some predatory birds which are said to be known as the active hunters which are ambush that prey and uh, some of the bugs and ants use it to have a mutualistic relationship with the ants in their life cycle and there are some bugs which use it to act as a human pest so the bed bugs use it to have a long history of association with the human which comes into the hemiptera and they feed at night and hide in bed mattress and cracks in floors and wall during days and host located by the body by temperature odor as well as the co2 which is released from the human body and the, while seeing the important families of the heteroptera they are geridae rigunidae simsidae tignidae miridae ligeridae pyrocoridae coridae pentatomidae neptidae and belostomatidae so these are the 11 important families we must need to remember in heteroptera and the important families of homoptera which is used to compose of cicadidae membranidae cicadidae cercopoidae delpacidae lopopidae pisaridae alurotidae and apididae coccidae dis diaspridae chiridae and pseudococcidae so these are the 13 important families we must need to remember in homoptera and uh, after that we first we are going to see about the homoptera which is used to compose of apididae which use mainly compose of aphids they use it to have a body pear shape and they use it to have a pair of cornicles on the fifth and sixth abdominal segments in the body and uh, cicadellidae which is used to compose of green leaf hoppers where you can able to see them in this picture and glh so which is the nepotitic virus an important vector of many diseases in plants and a uh, homoptera and we are going to see another family which is delphacidae which is a brown leaf hopper uh, which is said to be known as the nelorpta lucets one of the important vector in ri rice and uh, cicadas insect uh, which is cicadidae which used to compose only of cicadas insects and uh, membranidae which used to compose of tree hoppers or cow bugs which is present in the plants and the cercopidae which is said to be known as the spittle bugs or cuckoo or uh, which is also known as the frog hoppers and uh, lopopidae which is said to be known as the aeroplane bugs based on the presence of the body nature and uh, it is said to be a important pest in sugarcane so they are said to be known as the sugarcane leaf hopper and which is said to be the scientific name is the pyrella pi purpusilla 
and uh, Faisal Day where they use it to be known as the jumping plant lies so they also to be known as the Asian citric Faisal Day where the scientific name is Diapora citri and uh, white flies which used to come under the family Aliroridae uh, Bemisia tabaki one of the important reasons for transmitting of many diseases which used to act as vectors in different crops and diaspora which is said to be known as the hot scale as well as the former this scale present in these groups and the coquitlae which is said to be known as the scale or soft scale insects which we use to suck the sap from different plants and caridae which is a lac insect which are also used to have a different economic importance in human evolution of producing lac uh, such as waxes etc and uh, mealy bugs so they use it to occur in groups and they if the presence of these which use it to weaken the plants in many group of insects and after that we are going to see about the heterotra which is said to be known as the true bugs and the species common names of these insects are said to be green sting bugs and the family or group name is said to be known as the sting bug and the scientific name is is pentatomidae and the food they are used to obtain is plant saps and after that we are going to see the brown sting bug with where the common name is sting bug and pentatomidae as well as the plant sap and a harlequin bug where they used to come under the family pentatomidae and a spined soldier bug which you which is also comes under the family pentatomidae and a squash bug which used to comes in the family of coridae and a leaf footed plant bug uh, comes under the coridae a giant water bug uh, which is also which, which is a predator uh, which used to eats of insects and small fishes which comes under the family belostomatidae and the bag swimmer one of the uh, aquatic insects which feeds on insects as well as the small in fishes which are used to act as a predator in insects comes under the family notonectidae and uh, wheel bugs so these are said to be known as the assassin bugs where they use it to predate on small insects and breads of the vertebrates so they use it to comes under the family rejuvidae and a uh, water stinger which is it comes under the family geridae which are used to live on live and dead insects by feeding them and the pyrocoridae which is a red cotton bug one of the major pest of cotton so they used to form a red color formation in the bowls which is the economic part of this crop so one of the major as well as the important pest in the cotton and uh, Simicidae, which is a bed bug, was one of the household pest in the hum humans. So I have given the lecture notes in description. So if you have any doubt, please comment in the section or else join us in the Instagram page. If you like the video, like it and share it with your friends and subscribe to BSC Agriculture and hit the bell icon to get regular updates. So thanks for watching the video. I'll catch you up in next videos.